Some of the latest trends have left us scratching our heads and asking, is it worth all the buzz or is it just a big old bust? So let's see. Dr. Batra, you're up. So the first trend is actually using nipple cream as a lip balm. So this has actually been all over social media and actress Margot Robbie is a big proponent of this. She says she's been doing this her whole life. She's never used lip balms because she feels that they may have ingredients that dry you out and actually keep you using them. So a lot of these lanolin based lip balms really hydrating. She feels like they have less preservatives and she almost exclusively will use this. So anybody have a venture? Buzz or bust? Um, buzz? Buzz. Interestingly, you're right. This is a buzz. So, do you give it a thumbs up? I, the Dr. Beats. Oh, right. So I do give this a thumbs up. I'm going to put a little on the back of Dr. Nita's hand. Yeah. And so what this is, lanolin is derived from the glands that sheep have that are sort of similar to our sebaceous glands. It's a lipid concentration that's actually very similar to the barrier of the outer layer of our skin mm. in humans. So this is a really great non-drying emollient. Now my only hesitation to qualified buzz mm -hmm. is that some people are allergic to lanolin because it's derived from wool. So if you have a wool allergy, please don't use this. But otherwise a really nice hydrating agent. You know, a lot of a lot of bang for your buck if you get a big two of this. I've got some <laughs> left over. Maybe. <laughs> and you can use it as a nipple cream. So once Not again, that, that, that was a buzz, this right? That's a buzz. Yeah. I love it. Very cool. Yeah. All right. So I think we have another one that we have to put to the test here. So we do. So this is for all of us who have lighter blonde hair, who maybe swim in the summer and it turns green, or maybe if you tend to color your hair and it gets that ashy green hue. Really? That's a thing? <laughs> that, I know. I know that doesn't really apply to us. That's, that's a thing. But, but it is actually a pretty common question I get, especially here in Southern California where people are swimming all through the summer and then the blondes come in and they're turning green. The idea of using this is ketchup. And so it's really interesting. You want to wet your hair and then you actually will put ketchup where you have this green hue and you can leave it on for 10 to 20 minutes and then rinse it off, follow it with your favorite shampoo and conditioner. and. What do you think, buzz or bust? Buzz. buzz. Well, so you could tell, yes, I was enthusiastic about this. This is actually a buzz. And yeah, because that was the after picture in that, Correct. In that yeah. image. I mean, her she lost that green hue to her hair. Is that common? That was really green. It's actually a okay. really cool chemical reaction. Yeah. So if you've ever wondered why if you're blonde and your hair turns green in the pool, it's because there are copper molecules in the pool water that the chlorine causes an oxidation reaction and then that protein binds to your hair. So just like copper pennies turn green when they uh -huh. oxidize, yes. so does blonde hair. And so the the genius of this is that it has two things. It's red, and red on a color wheel balances out green. So that's one way to neutralize the color. I always tell my rosacea patients to look for green mm. colored makeup. But the cool chemical thing in this is that ketchup has vinegar, which is acetic acid, and that actually slows down that oxidation process. So this is chemistry at work. This is why we talk about sometimes using vinegar on apples and avocados to keep them from browning. It's the same idea that if you put acetic acid in this context, it's going to slow down on that green reaction in your hair. So two good reasons, the color as well as the chemistry, really good hat. Wow. What, what about for like gray or silver hair? Yeah. No, just the asking same for idea. a friend. Asking well, if you're asking friend. for a friend. If, yeah, you're, if your gray turns green, this may help. No, yes. sometimes a it does. A lot of it does, it yeah. It does, and they have same special reaction. shampoos, you know, that have certain things, so maybe I'll, I'll just. try ketchup. I might try ketchup. Yeah, yeah so definitely a buzz. Really interesting at home. Ooh. Love that. Yeah. Interesting. You chemist, you.